uh welcome back this is going to be a video in plinkerton uh hopefully i can get it to find out soon uh this is gonna be southeast amp uh so if you have this amp it gets hit from the north and the east i will be attempting to make uh, all of it in one uh video so let's just start now and stop wasting time so first these are all going to be spawned here they're going to spawn around here and here there's going to be all the strip of uh to like whatever land here that they're gonna go so we can make the path now uh this is gonna be the path for the husks and i'm gonna wall everything off except for here so if you want to make this work the best uh you can copy exactly what i do and it will work Now, uh, you add ceilings over everything, of course, and over here, uh, add ceilings all the way over until here. You can add a connection point here if you want to. Uh, you don't need to though. Um, I'm just gonna add ceilings the whole way through. Uh, yep, there we go. I'm getting it wrong. Okay, there we go. They do spawn here, I think, so I'm going to not place anything there, and just deal with that, like this, and anything that gets here will be destroyed by these traps here that we're going to place. You can kind of assume what type of traps we're going to place there. Um, anyway. Uh, this is also going to be like unpatchable, so you'll never need to update this ever, no matter what happens. Uh, even if there's a like, ground big bug in the game, you're not gonna have to update this ever. So that's uh, that's a really good uh, bonus about this base that I've designed. Uh, is that, yeah, you don't have to upgrade or update it ever, so you can just run it all day. Now, um, I'm going to go back here and we're gonna make some spawn trapping. It's very easy spawn trapping. You want to go right here. This first little block off. Okay, right here. Cone. And then go one, two. And then you place two to the north. And one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And one, two, for safety reasons. One, two there. Um, now, this is a two by seven, uh, starting from here. You can add more connection points uh, all around here too, if you have the structures and if you want to do that. Now, the best part about this is that you can also add walls up here with wall darts. Okay. So you can kill things in a spawn. And there is essentially maximum spawn trapping for this. You know, wall here with a window. Okay. Let's go to the traps, and I'm just gonna place some really quickly. Gas all in here, no matter what. Use gas. Gas is your best friend, okay? When it's not two tiles high, gas is your best friend. Ceiling electrics in here. Very, very, very easy traps. You don't need one here, but you, I place. Okay, I'm stupid. Just, just, just don't place that one if you don't want. To. I might do something though. Um. Oh. Cool. Uh, that's ADHD. Okay. Anyway, we're going to add wall darts all along here. Forgot to add wall darts here, but you have to add wall darts, or you don't have to, but you should. Um, these the uh, these tunnels do kill mini bosses, just so you know. All of them kill mini bosses. Two here. Okay, here's the main idea. Is that I'm gonna have a wall here with another one. So if anything wants to walk through here and then path around here and then down here, they're just gonna die instantly. They're gonna get nuked down by these. Uh, that's the idea. You can also add a ceiling here if you want, but you don't have to. It's not required. Spawn trapping. More ceiling electrics. And 
Let's get some of these. This max crit damage doesn't really matter. You don't have to try that hard in uh, Plankerton. It's just like a step above stone wood, you know. So, uh, let's see. God, where are my? I'm so stiff. I'm tired. Okay, leave me alone. I can't find my darks. So, I mean, yeah, my darks. Can't find them. All right, go down here. You don't need anything on these walls, by the way. Just this. Uh, maybe you can add. Uh, this and this, but you don't, you don't need to. Oh, yeah, okay. There we go. Max should be enough wall darts uh, to hold this up. Uh, yeah. I think this is good. You can add... So if something wants to break through that, then I can break through that. Okay. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm stupid. I didn't mean to place one here. You don't have to- don't place that there. Uh, so dumb. Don't place that there. Stupid. Just do this here, and then on the outside, maybe like a sound wall or something. But an actual sound wall, not that one. Okay. Uh, here, you want to actually place... Drop drops. Um, it's, uh, more viable here. If you place drop drops. Now. Let's get on to the next one. Next one, they all spawn right here. They don't break a tile here, so we can start here. Now, main path is this right here, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add another path here. So there's gonna be split pathing. Now, it should be that complicated to build here. Um, there's a lot of options, but it's the best option here. Add a cone because it looks cooler. There we go. All right. Now, we're not going to kill them. What we're going to do is go up here, start from here. Okay, see this on the spawn, little hill? Start from here. And go one, two, three, four. Stop here. Go one, two, three, four. There we go. That is our main spawn trap here. They all spawn like around here and stuff. Um, there might be a rare spawn here. Just wall this off for now. I will test more if there's a rare spawn here, I'll update it. I promise. I gotta upgrade every I gotta update a lot, so I'm under that pressure too, but it's okay. You will get through. Now. Go here. Add these. This here. And this. And this. This wall is very important. So hopefully you add support themes like here. So they won't break. No. Main idea of the tunnel is to split path them as usual. So, what you want to do is well, split path them. And you can easily do this just like this. So, as you can see, perfect. So, when you split path them like this, they're either going to go here or down here. So, now that we have the split kind of thing, we can add the rest of our builds here. Yep. Yeah. Alright. Perfect. So, I decided to double check to make sure that I placed everything right. So, you will have a working base. I think. Just, just say that you will. Not me, you. <laughs> Alright. No, don't think that's it. Okay, trapping. I'm just gonna go to the one three four, it's easier. Wall darts. Now you can choose between broadsides, but I'll place broadsides here for the testing purpose of this. Place broadsides here and darts on the other side. Although every dart won't hit, it's okay, because it still does tons of damage. And you will be able to kill... Did I forget floor traps? Oh my god, did I? I, fl I forgot floor traps, yep. And a lot of... Okay. <sighs> I'm such a noob. I'm a noob. Okay. Don't, don't listen to me ever. Trust me. It's not a good idea. Alright. 
Let's place some retractables here, just to nuke down every. And you can add... Do I have freeze traps on me? No, I don't. A stack of these. Um, you can add freeze traps at the start. Because if you add freeze traps at the start, it kills all the... Kills all the unnecessary stuff. So... Well, it doesn't kill it. It just helps it die faster. So I'm gonna add freeze here. I'm actually going to add a floor spike at the beginning too. Nice floor spike. You're in floor spike at the beginning. May as well just add a dart here because just keys just because you can. Uh, double damage reload. There we go. Just add that. Let's just do it. Let's see what happens. At the end of the tunnel, you want to add your retractables by the way. Retractables are doing a lot of damage here uh, in this scenario. So, just having them uh, makes it better. So, I'm all over the place right now, so I'll stop doing that. Um, hopefully that's not the only thing I forgot. Hopefully that is the only thing I forgot. <laughs> Alright, now... Better idea to do this. You can add a sound wall to each side. Perfect. I'm gonna add a purple one, but you don't need to add a purple one. I'm gonna do it because I can, but you don't have to. Um, just for the memes, I really want to do it. It shouldn't matter. It shouldn't really matter. I'm gonna add a flame grill just for the memes. A flame grill. Now here, we, this is serious. You actually want to add freeze and wall dynamo. Um, if anything gets trapped under here, instantly nuked and it gets uh, sound walled if it doesn't get uh, frozen because of the bug. Now, you're going to add three up. And don't use impact, you don't need impact. Freeze, 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 freeze. The reason you get three up is because most things are gonna go through here and then like different things, I don't know what they are going through here, but they will go through here. Um, different things will go through here. Different purposes. Um, it's a little complicated. Uh, I should explain it though. Basically, with a split path, it's close. Okay, so this is closer to the camp. Um, some things are going to go through here because it's a split path, obviously. Um, but if um, you have a split path, there is going to be split durability because this is this is not that long of a tunnel. This is not that long of a tunnel. Um, so if you have more like area, surface area for the tunnel, then you get a better path. I don't know how to explain it that. I don't know how to explain that level, but I'm, that's the best I can do. Uh, we're going to add these here. And retractables at the end, of course. My favorite trap. And that should be almost everything so for the ceilings, of course. Um, you're going to add ceiling drop trap here. And you are going to add these. Uh, ceiling electrics. These are the perks on them, they're just one reload in normal. You don't have to make them 144, by the way, you can make them 130. Because it's only 116. You can make them 116 if you want. But, I recommend wall darts on the outside to nuke everything now. And, there you go. You want that facing this way so they'll push away. But it won't really matter because it's uh, blank Uh, Down below here, uh, nothing's gonna face through. But, you know, just, just in case, just like add this and a freeze trap. Now, here we want the ceiling zapper and a part and you want to make it completely just overkill damage uh tunnel to nuke it if anything even makes it here you don't have to add nature and these are garbage perks but jesus christ these are horrible um don't don't use this why do i have this <laughs> i'm not re uh, I'm recycling these actually i can make them better don't use these Don't use those. That's disgusting. Don't use all the easy use. There we go. Beautiful. Now, um, I do have uh, fully crit build ones, right? These are one reload. Do I have my crit builds? Here. Yeah. Full crit build. And these are crit build too. But I just have healing on them. I think these are frost knight perks. Yeah. I'm not changing them. It doesn't really matter too much. Um, and here you can add it. Uh, and personally, 
I like to add little walls around here with uh, ceiling zappers in case anything wants to target them. That's just me. You don't have to. Uh, mini bosses will die. Just saying. Oh, almost forgot this. There you go. So, um, nothing's actually going to make it to the end of here. Even a mini boss, I don't think, is ever going to make it to the end. Um, but if it does, you're in luck. Um, so if you want to do this and build this and test it out, and if this works perfect, then uh, you're good to leave the video. Um, but come back if it does not work. And this uh, will be a solution to not working. So if mini bosses spawn up here, and they go through here, and somehow uh, they don't die, which is shocking to me because there's that. Um, if they're on 1 HP, you can do this. Here we go. So these are one of my favorite type of kill tunnels, like little macaronis, but they do tons of damage. So, um, that's what I like to call them, little macaronis. We're gonna call them like little macaronis. We're gonna, we're gonna make that thing. Make that thing. Little macaronis. Um, you just add uh, darts everywhere, and you add zappers, and it's just fun. Very fun tunnel here. Um. Retractables. Retractables are your highest damage, by the way, if you don't know. Um, highest damage uh, trap. Higher than uh, flame grills and floor spikes aren't the best because they snare. And if you, even if you use damage carpets, you have to have a broadside to go off. And if these crit, they do an unspeakable amount of damage, okay? <laughs> they do an unspeakable amount of damage. Um, so, uh, there we go. So test it out, make sure it works, and, um, yeah. And if you want to be safe, you know what, just like, just add these here if you really want to be, because some husks uh, can't sneak down here, they don't get killed by these, and they'll go here. Uh, I don't think this is doing anything, but I'm not breaking it. Um, they, they shouldn't do anything here. Uh, yeah, they, they shouldn't go down here. If even they go down here, they got seen electric fields, um, probably little husks, so it'll be fine. Um, if there's any flinger, it, there should never be a flinger issue on this amp, by the way, just so you know. Um, but if there is, um, just forgot this. Yikes. Hopefully, no one forgets this. I'm doing this all in one take, I'm not recording another one. Um, yeah, if they, um, somehow want to path over here and don't die all you gotta do is do this and there we go perfect um without the rocks of course because i haven't broken mine yet because i'm too lazy um and on this same uh, same idea except for the fact that what you want to do is jeez i'm s selling out here oh my god i'm selling so hard um what you want to do is you want to add well, first of all, you want to cap this off. You want to cap this off because they're uh, either going to go back around here, which is a very simple fix. Um, I the USB level face here. I don't know why they broke that. Um, just broadside these. They're not going here, um, just so you know. But you want to broadside and then tar because the flingers are actually pretty flat, uh, fast. So if you tar them. They'll just, uh, so, you know, they'll just stop, and they won't move. Uh, up here, I'm gonna add two darts, but I don't think there's a spawn up here, but if there is, then there is, and, uh, I don't know. If it doesn't work, then I'll fix it, of course. Um, yeah, wall dart, you, you got the idea, right? You, you guys got the idea. So you'll hopefully manage to... Thanks, Epic. You'll, uh, hopefully manage to make a good build with this. Um... Um, I made this entire amp myself. Um, just you know, this is all mine, and I did make this in another base, and it did work. So, yeah, that is the entire uh, entirety of the Southeast Amp in Fortnite City World. Now make sure you get an aerial view of the amp too. So here's the entire amp. Um.
It's a little expensive, uh, a little more on the expensive side, but it's worth it if you do have the structures, if you really want to kill many bosses and uh, rack up combat score. So yeah. Thanks for watching. Um, there's no mini boss TP because um, there's no mini boss. Uh, so you're lucky in that one. Um, thanks for watching though. I appreciate it. And then make sure to consider dropping a subscribe. You know, just press the sub button. It's like it's a single button. Like it's just a single button. It's like press. I mean, I'm close to a hundred. Just like, just like, just like click it because it's like simple, right? Like every time you subscribe, it makes me want to make like another video. Just like do that. Please. Uh, and then, um, let's see, let me know if there's any issues. Just like, let me know in the comments if there's any issues. Because there should never be an issue with Sam. There's no issues for me when I test it out. There's no issues. Uh, just let me know if there is an issue. If there is, I will make sure to address it. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye.